Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting and going to episode 49 of Hero Gato Sky. Pretty curious, let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> No. I mean, wing. Babe, no, Kissy, baby can't, I can't say that. But baby hasn't seen any previous series of Pretty Hair. Any other season, the bad guy ain't defeated that quickly. We have, like, phase one, phase two, phase three, and then, only then, he is defeated, he or she, whoever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> I just realized next Saturday is going to be the last time we're going to hear this song. And I don't know how to feel about that. And, and that's when I probably am going to make a real, like I've done, it's now kind of traditional now, <laughs> to making a really long video uh, talking about everything and how I think everything was done so I mean expect that next week because what delicious party was like 55 minutes like almost an hour really so the goal is to at least get around that or a little bit over I'm gonna try not to do an hour but knowing me because I am going there is a lot to talk about I might end up doing it an hour That wouldn't even work. Even if you pull that out. But wouldn't she die if she does that though? See? I told you. I freaking told you. It was all him. You were a pawn, just as much as your dad was. And of course, he uh, he overheard everything. You tell me you did it right here? Oh, that's so messed up. But he just made it look like. Mm -hmm. Just to get you on his good side. Because he wants to see the world burn.
and you were the perfect vessel. The heck? Once again, can we just talk about the fact, and, and we're going to talk more about this next week, but like two for two for two different seasons where a guy who has slowly been surely shown in the show is our final villain. I mean, we've seen that technically before, but... The way this ish was done, oh my god. Because you would automatically think it would be the Empress and such. Even though she didn't get a lot of screen time. But the fact that it's him is just crazy. But it makes the most sense. He's the one that we've been, they've been with and, you know, gone against the most out of all three. We know that was a lie, too. Sky, you can't go by yourself. Of course it is. Shush! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Alright, you know what this part reminds me of? You remember that one episode in Sailor Moon where, you know, she's just walking, it's all of them all together, and then next thing you know, Usagi gets separated. Something tells me, in the end, Sora's gonna get separated from them. They're all probably gonna get separated. So someone's got to say, of course, my babies have to stay. Oh my God. You have to.
by, like, once again, the dream team of a duo of a guy. They're gonna get separated again. Like, it, something tells me either Majesty is gonna stay behind or at least Prism. They literally are like, yep, Kaguya's got to stay. Komi has to stay. It's just too emotional. Like, literally just having them all be separated just hurts my soul. Because they're always stronger together. And it's just... I'm not going to cry, but I know myself I am. Stop. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, just let them all be okay. That's all I want. We just get in hand to hand combat for the rest of this. Okay, with a little bit of magic, but no. Just in that, like. <laughs> no, because he wants you to do that. That's not good.
I don't like the way this is going. If this ends badly this weekend, oh my god, I cannot imagine how, like, this last episode will go. This ain't gonna end good. How many minutes we got left? We got six minutes left. Oh my god, don't do this to me. This is the darkest episode in this series. Oh, God. I can't. This is like freaking... Not, not only Hakuto healing goods is in this situation. Go princess information! Oh, my God! Best love. Goodbye. <laughs> to the fucking wives. Wives. This episode. I can't right now. <laughs>
just because you lost your way doesn't mean you can't change yourself. Have my girlfriend beside me. Have my wife beside me. Mm -hmm. That's all it is, Sora. I have my wife and my friends beside me. My wife was always there helping me every every little thing and same thing vice versa. I got like two minutes left. Because after this, I got to go get my Uber Eats food. <gasps> you made her. Okay, we're in. You know what? That's a good way to end it because something tells me, like, we're going in the first half of the next episode, we're going to get a good behind fight, and then we're going to see, you know, <laughs> we're going to see Kana from <laughs> Komayashi's Bay Dragon as a pretty care. Um, okay, this was very emotional. I mean, seriously, I did not think, because normally, depending on it, like, usually. Fight wise, final fight wise, it's super duper emotional for the girls and you know everyone else and people who watch it as well. But number one, to have Sky be taken over by Scarehead as a vessel, I'm sitting here thinking like we about to end this episode with a loss for these characters, and then how in the world like Prisma is gonna have to be like stepping up next week into this final episode. She's gonna have to go against her wife like. That's very emotional. Like, it, it gave feels towards, um, and probably maybe he, the, the person who created this series or the director for this series, um, most definitely watched, like, what, season two of Wings Club when that happened with Bloom becoming Dark Bloom and then, you know, her girlfriends and, you know, her boyfriend all, like, trying to save her and shit. Um, but also that's typical. That happens in, like, any other Magical Girl series. So he, he or she probably got very much like, oh, let's do this, let's do that. But no, that was really good on how they did that because I get it. Number one, he's like, oh, hey, only way to save your girlfriend slash wife is if you succumb to the darkness and become my vessel. And no matter what, like, she really did not want to. But in that moment, she had no choice. Oh my god, no, 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 I'm not ready. I'm not, I, you know what, never what, uh, never mind, I can't speak. I will never be fucking ready, regardless. No matter how many series of Pretty Fair I react to, I am never ready to the final, final episode, especially when you know it's the final time we're going to see these characters until they're in the next, like, um, all-star movie. It does make me wonder what they're going to do with the next all-star movie and such, um, when we do get there, but... The fact is that, you know, once again, after next week, we're not seeing these characters again until the movie. It, it sucks. But at the same time, once again, it's been a wild freaking journey. But I think, like, really, th this whole final battle, because this is, like, part three, we want to go into part four next week. Th this has been, like, psh, th once again, it Trump delicious party. Like, it it's a good behind fight. And, I mean, like, yeah, it has a little mixtures of both. I, I would have loved it if it was just, like, hand-to-hand -hand combat and stuff as someone who loves OG and new G stuff but I, I still love it regardless it is still good I think the cinematography for this episode was really good making sky go dark for a moment was very interesting um would love to see something like that again but that really depends on depends on how they want to do this next season because you know they're only I think as of right now they're probably like what halfway through recording um wonderful 
probably. But, of course, we won't know until after next week. But other than that, guys, that is my action view towards episode 49 of Hidogato Sky Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single night. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday or Sunday. We're going to try Saturday, just like it's me trying to get this out tonight. Um, for the final episode, aka, which will probably be over an hour long discussing every little thing in detail, final thoughts on everyone, um, the show, and then, of course, the things that I'm probably going to be ex wanting to expect for Wonderful, but when we also get to the start of Wonderful, we'll also talk about that, but, yeah. Until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!